Wait, can we skip it? Let's just get into it. Skip the tab because we already saw it. So, I think we did this one. Let's see the map. So, I'm going to check if we actually did the, the biomes. And there should be... I'm going to go back and do the whole entire... I'm gonna go back and try to get those biomes. Maybe I could just skip it. I wanna skip it. I wish I could skip these mines. I'm just trying to get the. Wait, please continue your testimony. Okay. I was riding alongside my partner and the armored man, but suddenly he spotted a bag on the side of the road. Yeah, I know we already saw this, but I'm just doing it. Was someone hiding in there. Objection! So, the defendant crawled into that bag in order to break into the bank. Is that correct? Is it not obvious? Is it really that obvious? I have proof that the defendant didn't hide himself in that bag. Well then, what are you waiting for? Present this evidence already. No, we gotta choose. Take that! What? Is, is that the bag the defendant hid in? Yes, but there's one thing that's been bothering me. If the defendant really was hiding in this bag, then... How did he tie the knot from the outside of the bag? What? If he was inside the bag, it'd be impossible for him to tie that knot on the outside. But then, how did he do it? It's simple. He didn't. What are you saying? I'm saying my client wasn't hiding in that bag at all. He was stuffed in there. By this very witness! As you can see by this doctor's analysis, the defendant had taken quite the beating. While he was in the bag, he was unconscious. This is absurd. The witness was attempting to dispose of the body. He left the defendant in the bag, knowing he'd drive by it on the way back to the bank. When the witness and his partner passed the bag, he convinced his partner to throw the bag in with the others. But, but why would he do that? Why, to dispose of the body, of course. There were millions of bags of money in that bank, and the witness knew it would take a long time before the victim was found. But unfortunately for the witness, his victim woke okay. up and tried to escape from his right. tomb. He was arrested okay. on the spot, and the witness thought everything was over. But it's come back to haunt him now. You guys can't, you can't, it's, it's, it can't be happening to me! Well, that certainly was an interesting trial. However, I am now ready to deliver my verdict. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman, not guilty. So, why am I doing this again? So I can get the... No, I forgot it. Let's just uh, see what we did last time. Now I'm going to do both hands. The, the two of them. Two that I've left. Fail. See. Yeah. I was trying to get the next one thing I had be if the Come on, you could use those hands. What was I even thinking there? Okay. Hmm? What the oh my Got it. Yes. Are you? Wow, that's unfair. Hmm? <laughs> I pressed. Oh. Uh... Yeah. 
Yes, I got all of them. Fatty, I'm not fatty. I was just getting all of them. I was just getting all the diamonds. I think I got all of them. I think we're almost out. Jetpack. Are you kidding? Okay. Oh, That's what the building looks like. Now look, you're back. And you're supposed to. I just. I knew that. I knew that. Now I'm gonna go to the map. And then that will escape. I wish I could do that. That means we have one option we didn't. What haven't we tried? We used energy. We we haven't used the drill yet. This has to work. Yes. Yes, we got that. And then it's obviously that when we use opacitator. Opacitator. You'll walk through walls. Go Abbott Gate. 2009. Just move the blue slider to right and you'll become a Good music. 
Yeah. So, bye guys. Hope you have a great time.